so has a checkered past. But here in Ryzen, looking to uh, become a formidable force in MMA, trains at AKA Thailand under UFC veterans Mike Quick Swick, Mark Hunt, and Soa Palele. He made his pro MMA debut in October 2015. Picking up a first round TKO. Then he picked up another first round TKO two months later. Last year, he signed with Ryzen, made his debut in September in the open weight Grand Prix against Rao Isidoro, winning via first round TKO. Then defeated short notice replacement Heath Herring via unanimous decision. And then in the final stage of the tournament, he faced Valentin Moldowski, winning the fight via split decision. But then was knocked out by tournament victor Mirko Prokop. As the tale of the tape shows us well, you're about to see two big boys throw down giants. Opener, 191.15 Santos, first time in Japan, but he watched all of the Pride events back in the day, and he never thought he'd be here. A dream come true. Five and one, three of those victories coming inside the distance for Amir Aliakbari, the superlative wrestler. Ten minutes, five minutes, two round match. No head batting, no elbow striking. Elbow no to the head are not permitted in this heavyweight attraction. And unlike the first heavyweight fight of the night, let's hope that these two heavyweights go at it like Wendy's and Hardy's on social media. The beef is in the rising ring. One more head, one more head. Wow. What do you look for early, Frank? Well, I mean, to me, it's whoever lands the first strike. I think Al Akbar is probably a better striker. Looks a little more balanced and centered. Or better striker when it comes to this game. Because I think uh, it's going to be a grappling match. We trade body shots in the clinch. Knee to the body by Los Santos. And this is uh, the position Ali Akbar wants to be. He's a Greco Roman wrestler. The go behind, waist lock by yep. Ali Akbari. And of course, we saw what he did against Heath Herring. Now into cross side position, the side control on Geronimo Dos Santos. Dos Santos has lost seven times via submission. But Ali Akbari has three knockout wins, no submissions yet. He's being crucified right now. Well, that's uh, Dos Santos in the crucifix position, ground and pound by Ali Akbari. And this is bad position for Dos Santos early in the fight. I can tell he's got no answer for it. <laughs> Hard part about this position is you start really putting energies into it. You start really getting nervous because you can't move your arm, you can't move your, your position at all. You start making silly escapes and wasting a lot of energy. You have a cool story about uh, one of Dos Santos, uh, or excuse me, Ali Akbari's coaches, Mike Swick, former oh, yeah. military member, contacted you back in the day? Back in the day, he used to be in uh, Afghanistan. He used to write me from the dirt, tell me he was going to be a fighter. He wanted to come to these states and uh, train him, train him for years, got him started. Yeah. AKA San Jose, of course, you were part of the founding members there with Javier Mendez, Crazy Bob Cook, and of course, uh, I want to congratulate Daniel Cordier successfully defending the UFC Light Heavyweight Championship. DC, a great ambassador to the sport, no matter what the fans think. <laughs> He's got to embrace that heel why persona. He's got to embrace the heel persona. Why don't they like him? He's the nicest yep. guy, too. 
It's so funny. As, as certain people, uh, people don't like. What a formidable force he was at heavyweight in Strike Force. Remember the Grand oh, Prix yeah. beating uh, Josh Barnett, no uh, throwing slouch, people throwing around. a body slamming. Yeah. Him. But Dos Santos, meanwhile, peppering Amir. Or excuse me, being peppered by Amir Ali Akbari, who has him in this crucifix and position. He's choking him now. Look at this choke. Oh yeah, he's sliding Short, this in. The forearm choke. Say what's funny is I bet you he wishes he had elbows now. That 30-pound weight uh, advantage in his disfavor, but he can show you some elbows right here. Oh. He is just trapped there. That arm is just tied up. Ali Akbari holding the other shoulder. Oh, there it is! Ground and pound from the crucifix. And Amir Ali Akbari vanquishes Geronimo Dos Santos to improve to six and one. Four wins via form of KO. Came down to position. Al Akbari had all the positions and just kept one. Just stayed there, crucified, worked it out. These are these are solid, solid shots. That was a need to stop fight. Los Santos just no understanding about him escape out of this position. That's a big, scary man. Bounces back from the loss to Mirko Krokop. Ali Akbari bests Geronimo Dos Santos via TKO. Team photo. So 10 fights in the books, one more coming your way. And this the first rising MMA event of the year as we begin the year long celebration, the 20th anniversary of the spiritual, well, forefather of rising pride fighting championships. And the Nexus for many shows, Mara, around the world.